We gotta tell the mayor what we saw. The mayor? What's he gonna do against frog monsters? He can't hold a gun. Can't even run. He's been running this town for 80 years. He'll know what to do. Oh, sedentary. Home sweet home. You saved my ass back there, big man. Ah, you got the magic, bro. All I got is strength, wisdom, charisma, good looks. I can do you one better than that. A fried bologna sandwich. Okay, let's talk to the old man. Elvis, the boy with the magic glove. Mayor, listen, this is gonna sound crazy, but we saw monsters. Real monsters. What's with the hunched shoulders and sour puss, boy? I keep telling you, if you don't project power, someone's gonna take it from you. You heard what he said, old man. Monsters, right outside town. I'm talking to the smart one, you tin brain dick. Okay, say that again. <laughs> Diggs, calm down. Trash can. What's he yakking about, monsters? That's what they were. Big, nasty frog things. They killed the Vodder family. Damn near killed us, too. Loads of them are coming for the town. You gotta do something. Mm -hmm. I knew this day was coming. What you mean you knew? It was the last full moon. Mayor of Pikeville was screaming at me on the radio about some invasion. I sent the sheriff out there for a look-see. He said the townspeople were gone, and the streets were covered with giant sacks of eggs. Frog eggs. We can't let that happen here. You can get the town to fight. This is a mining town. We mine. No, the miasma's changing, behaving differently. It's more important than ever. You get through that wall. And find your mama, Bob Mati. She's the only one who might know what's going on. Like it or not, Elvis, the fate of our town is in your fingers. Yeah, about my fingers. The glove's dead. I blew out the power core. Well, go find a new power core and come back here pronto. I'll take another look at your mama's data drive. See if she left any clues on how to keep that glove from breaking. And one more thing. Do not leave town. It's too dangerous out there. to get a power core. Murthus? Fat chance, little brother. After the shit you pulled. Fate of the town's in my fingers, right? Elvis? Oh, hell no. Get out. Bertha, please. All we need is one fresh power core. You blew up my car. Last damn car in town. You know how expensive that thing was? I do, and I'm sorry. My glove misfired, and... Uh, listen, we're on official mayor business. I don't care if the mayor comes here and karate chops me with his tiny arms. Supplies are limited. I got merchants disappearing in the miasma. First family's giving me shittier gear. But if you happen to find me a torque jammer, maybe I'll forgive you for killing my car and give you a power core. Listen, we don't have... Uh, I got your torque jammer, Bertha. <laughs> oh, yeah? It's right out back. And, uh, Bertha, while I'm out there, I'll be holding on to the memory of your beautiful face. Okay. Get me that gem, and the core is yours. Better hurry. It's my last one. No talk, Gemma. No service. Get out. 
What the hell are you telling her? Grabbing a talk jam is easy, little brother. Just gotta know where to grab. Georgia's been picked clean. I haven't seen Georgia in a while. Look what the gate. I walk past your shop, Elvis. It looks like hammer shit. All right, because this place is immaculate. <laughs> Smells good, too. Don't try to get on my good side, Elvis. I no longer have one. Now, I know you want to find your mama, and no one's going to tell you different. But this town needs a good mechanic, especially with the first family up our asses. Mayor J. Mason, make all the jokes you want, but that man refuses to die. When he lost his legs, he dragged his butt through a half-mile tunnel. When he lost his arms, he fought tooth and nail to become mayor of this town. He must be over a hundred years old, still sharp as a knife. He might live forever. Mm. Be careful of men who refuse to kick the bucket. They'll do anything it takes to hold on. Anything. Years ago, we used to trade with the first family face to face. Now they just send their robotic flunkies to squeeze us dry. <laughs> Damn collectors. They take our gold, and in return, they give us just enough supplies to keep us digging. But where else are we gonna buy supplies? They got us bent over a log, all right. So we tell the first family to get lost. What's so hard about that? That's what Elizabeth Town did. Where are they now? Underground, buried in rubble. You know what vexes me? What does the first family do with all that gold? You know, I really wanted your mama to come back. You miss her? Nah, I wore 50 plastic. She skipped town before I could pay her back. She's been gone so long, though. Might as well give it to you. Really? I don't know, Georgia. She's not coming back. I'm sorry. Take the money and bury the past. Years ago, we... Now they, they take away... Our... So we tell... That's what... You know what? You ruminate. Surrounds our town on all sides, but we shall not fear the miasma. There's a girl. I haven't seen her around town before. Hey, what's your name? My name. Nice. Hey, yo, Elvis. Sheriff gave me pretty sick guard in the hey. Oh, well, yeah, don't think, sir. Her name's Jade. Heard she's a great you and true. Not a day. You saw he saw him. He said he, he just stayed. Boom. I got some. Maybe. Well, these try shooting him. <laughs> Good luck. Let's make this quick. I got a bad feeling about Gator Zone. Well, I got a good one. You want to fix your glove, right? Let's get Bertha what she wants. Sure, searching the wasteland for a tool the size of my hand. No sweat. I got your back, you got mine. Everything's easy peasy.
entry. Local fauna mutating twice as fast as last. Baxter, you shouldn't be. A my asthma spread. Find out and you're not my. This place is evil, Baxter, and you're full of light. Seriously, dragging your. Aww. Yeah. No. What? It's cool. Oh. Am I... No sh. You don't. What? There's been the angry. Exactly. Screw. Uh. What? I got him. <laughs> okay. I can't. <laughs> Good seeing you, Elvis. Ah, shit. More frog monsters. Keep cool, little brother. Remember hunting coyotes with mama? If we sneak up on the bastards, we can ambush them. That gives us the first move. What if they see us? Where's Guru? <laughs> Filled these shells with all kinds of things. Two bodies frozen in my asthma. They look super old. Calcified. You think they were? Yeah. I'm going this way. Okay, follow me. Solo. Deader than dead. Nothing good happens in Gator Zone. I can smell that torque jammer from here. Some other loot, too. Look around.
That old timer needs help. We'll sneak in and ambush these bastards. What the hell are you doing? What do you want from me? Down for the count! Bastards are tricky digs, watch out! Check on the old man. fought these monsters in a great war. History repeats, I guess.
He has saved my life. Hey, you're Bamati's boy, aren't you? Yeah, that's me. You better get back to sedentary. Like that, safer? Your ma used to protect our town. You know that? Without her magic. Don't know how we're gonna keep this evil from killing us. As sure as night turns to day, old man, we're gonna find her. Yeah? Then you're gonna need my backpack. I got a frag grenade and medipod inside. Hmm. Guess you're saving our lives. <laughs> Much obliged, old timer. Don't you worry about me. Just getting my breath back. God damn. There's no end to these bastards. We gotta take them down. Hold on now. I see a torque jammer. We can't fix your glove without it. Ah, time to shine, little brother. Frogs bunch up, pop them with a grenade. Dig. What you waiting for?
could really use a pick-me-up. Like now. <laughs> I... How about we grab this thing and go home, okay? Diggs, you were right. A torque jammer. Rusty, but it'll do. Let's get back to Bertha. You must be this tall to ride. Looks like you're sitting this one out, Elvis. <laughs> Thank you. 
saw monster. He saw him. He said he could just stay. Boom. I got the man. Well, trash. You saw him. He, he, he just stayed where he was. Boom. Boom. Good luck. Let's get this torque jammer to Bertha. You did good, little bro. Like I always say, he who dares, wit, wit, wit. Thanks, Diggs. You're skipping again. Elvis and Diggs. Still using those. Yeah, Pete. Tougher pro. Maybe you can. Hell, I rejiggered and hop. Not disagree. Come on, find up. As your powerful a holes. Rich beyond dropping. No thanks. Okay, plastic. Uh, we been. Uh, nope. Next this. Don't be me. Stay strong. Elvis, when you opening your shop again? My cleaner lot needs fixing. Collection day's coming. Hate these first family bastards. Well, to survive, the town had to make a deal with the devil. Well, these devils are squeezing the town dry. Wish I could do something about it. When we die, we go to California. Here's a torque jammer, Bertha. Hey, hey. And deal's a deal. Rock and roll. Say, where'd you get that glove? My mama gave it to me. Wanna sell it? Not in a hundred lifetimes. Thanks, Bertha. Thank you right back. Stores open to you boys anytime. about your bravery and shit. I like it. What do you need? Anyone leaving town needs a weapon to defend themselves. That's my asthma 101. It's hella dangerous out there. You want to shoot more? Shoot farther? All that good stuff? Upgrade your weapon. Bye. Welcome to... That core working? Like a dream. Let's get back to the mayor. Hmm. Interesting. Got that glove working, boy? It's working, Mayor. Not a second too soon. Gator Zone's crawling with monsters. Why the hell were you in Gator Zone? This brainless pot dragon? Uh, brains is all you got, Jarhead. <clears throat> Elvis, I hit the jackpot. Found an encrypted file in your mama's data drive. It's all about increasing your glove's power. Hell yeah. What's it say? Well, that's the problem. I can't understand a goddamn lick of it. Read this. To heal the miasma and pay our debts, absorb the anger of a wild, 
vortex. In return, the miasma gives an editor a reward. Power for your glove, and balance restored. Some kind of riddle. You know what she means? Heal the miasma. Editor? I don't get it. Mean? Damn it! Tornado? Yes, yeah, we're like a... Maybe, but the front... Wanna see that? Yeah, cool. Godspeed.